You ever have a woman friend tell you something that happened that she says is sexist, and deep down you're like, I don't see how it was. (laughs) I'm going to give you a tool, and this is going to actually be fun. It's a game you can play silently in your head, and then you're going to go, oh, I see what she means. It's called, Would a Cishet Man Say This to Another Cishet Man? And it's a great game show, and it's weird because the answer is always no. Um, But I don't know if women relate to this, but when you're getting in an elevator, you don't want to get in with a guy you don't know, and you don't want to get in with a group of guys that know each other. Both very scary. But I will get on an elevator with a guy and another guy who don't know each other because they are never going to act creepy to a woman in front of each other, if that makes sense, because they don't know if the other guy's gonna back him up or not. So they're gonna act normal, and I'm like, I feel safe. I get on the elevator with these two gentlemen, we're all strangers, and we're all looking at our phones and not speaking like normal fucking people in society should. (laughs) Now, one of the guys gets off the elevator, and I'm like, oh shit, I've gotta ride up alone with this other guy, five more stops. I'm like, how bad could it be? I forgot, sexism only takes a second. And so uh, the door is shut, and this guy looks at me, he goes, pretty big suitcase you got there and he goes you must be an overpacker and I'm like "Mm." and I want to be like it's filled with fucking books I wrote but I don't and then he goes but seriously how long are you really staying are you really going to wear all those outfits in there and the doors open I don't say anything I was so proud of myself and I get off the elevator and he goes get over yourself honey and the door is shut and I'm like "Uh so I told a guy friend that story he goes that get over yourself honey was super sexist He goes, but I don't think he was sexist up until then. I think he was just being nice, making conversation. And I'm like, okay, time for America's favorite game show. (laughs) Would a straight guy say this to another straight guy in an elevator? The answer is always no. So now let's do, 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 play the game again. Three guys in an elevator, one guy with a big suitcase, one guy gets off the elevator, elevator door shut, one straight cis male says to the other straight cis male, pretty big suitcase there. (laughs) You know that's never gonna happen. You must be an overpacker. All right, buddy. That's where that guy's getting fucking punched. Because 